The authors propose MOFO, a novel momentum filtered optimizer designed to mitigate forgetting in large language model, LLM, fine tuning. Forgetting occurs when a model's performance on its pre training task degrades after being fine tuned on a downstream task. This phenomenon is particularly problematic in LLMs, where the pre training task is often crucial for the model's overall performance. The authors begin by discussing the limitations of existing optimizers, such as SGD and Atom, which can exacerbate forgetting due to their lack of consideration for the model's pre training task. They then introduce the concept of momentum filtered optimization, which aims to balance the model's updates between the pre training and fine tuning tasks. The MOFO algorithm is presented as a modification to the Atom optimizer, where the momentum term is filtered to prioritize updates that are beneficial to both the pre training and fine tuning tasks. The filtering process is based on a novel momentum filtering mechanism, which computes the cosine similarity between the gradients of the pre training and fine tuning tasks. The authors provide a mathematical formulation of the MOFO algorithm, which involves the following key components the momentum term, backquote m underscore t backquote, which is computed as the exponential moving average of the gradients the filtering term, backquote f underscore t backquote, which is computed as the cosine similarity between the gradients of the pre training and fine tuning tasks the update rule, which combines the filtered momentum term with the gradients of the fine tuning task the authors also provide a theoretical analysis of the MOFO algorithm which shows that it can effectively mitigate forgetting by balancing the model's updates between the pre-training and fine-tuning tasks. The paper also presents experimental results, which demonstrate the effectiveness of MOFO in mitigating forgetting in LLM fine-tuning. The results show that MOFO outperforms existing optimizers, such as Atom and SGD, in terms of both pre-training and fine-tuning performance. The authors conclude this section by highlighting the significance of their contributions, which include the proposal of a novel momentum filtered optimizer and a theoretical analysis of its effectiveness in mitigating forgetting. They also discuss the limitations of their work, including the assumption that the pre training and fine tuning tasks are related, and the need for further research on the applicability of MOFO to other domains. The paper addresses the issue of forgetting pre training knowledge during the fine tuning process in large language models, LLMs. It highlights that incorporating pre training data into the fine tuning process can significantly increase computational and memory costs. Regularization based methods, which add penalty terms to the loss function to encourage the fine tuned model to remain close to the pre trained model, may impair the model's performance on the fine tuning task. The authors propose a replay free and regularization free method called the Momentum Filtered Optimizer, MOFO, to mitigate forgetting during fine tuning. MOFO selects and updates only the parameters with the top alpha percent largest momentum magnitudes within each block at each iteration. This method is motivated by the observation that the fine tuning loss of LLMs has many minima, and these minima can vary significantly in their distances to the pre trained model. The authors note that minima closer to the pre trained model are less likely to experience forgetting. The paper also presents an initial convergence analysis of the MOFO algorithm and conducts experiments on various tasks, demonstrating that MOFO outperforms existing methods both in fine tuning performance and mitigating forgetting. An illustrative example using the Pythia 160 meters model fine tuned on a subset of the FLAN dataset shows that different training methods converge to different minima, with closer minima being less likely to forget pre training knowledge. The paper addresses the issue of forgetting in fine tuning pre trained models, specifically Pythia 160 meters, on common sense tasks. It is observed that the Atom optimizer tends to converge to a minimum that is significantly farther from the pre trained model, leading to a higher pre training loss and forgetting. In contrast, the Lion optimizer converges to a minimum with similar fine tuning loss but closer to the pre trained model, resulting in less forgetting. To mitigate forgetting and achieve comparable performance in fine tuning tasks, the authors propose modifying the Atom optimizer by updating the subset of parameters with the largest momentum magnitude. This approach is inspired by the classical block coordinate descent BCD, method, which updates only a subset of parameters at each iteration, resulting in smaller adjustments to the parameters compared to full parameter fine tuning with Atom. 
The authors also present lost landscapes of Pythia 160 meters after fine-tuning on a subset of the Flan dataset using Atom and Lion optimizers. They find that the two training methods converge to different minima with similar fine-tuning loss, with Lion converging to a minimum that is significantly farther from the pre-trained model and archives a much larger pre-training loss. Additionally, the authors provide Pythia 160M's accuracies on common sense tasks after being fine-tuned with the Atom and Lion optimizers. Atom achieves less forgetting than Lion on average, supporting the conjecture that the severity of forgetting during fine-tuning correlates with the distance between the fine-tuned model and the pre-trained model. The Momentum Filtered Optimizer, or MOFO, is an algorithm designed to enhance the fine-tuning process in deep learning models. It partitions all parameters into B-fixed parts and uses a momentum filtering mechanism to select the most influential parameters for updates. This process is illustrated in Figure 2. MOFO initializes momentum and variance as zero tensors and iterates through the following steps until convergence. For each partition k from 1 to b, it computes the gradient g, k, t of the loss function with respect to the kth partition of size dk. It then updates the momentum m, k, t and variance v, k, t using the atom optimizer's update rules. The filtered momentum m, k, t and variance v, k, t are computed by dividing m, k, t and v, k, t by 1 beta t1 and 1 beta t2, respectively. The algorithm then applies a filtering mechanism to select the top alpha percent momentum entries in each partition. This is done by comparing the magnitude of each momentum entry against the top alpha percent of all momentum entries in the partition. The selected entries are marked with a filter value of 1, while others are set to 0. Finally, the parameters are updated using the filtered momentum and variance. The update rule is similar to the atom optimizer, but only the parameters with a filter value of 1 are updated. This process is repeated for all partitions and iterations until convergence. MOFO efficiently selects and updates the most influential parameters, enhancing the fine-tuning process while alleviating the catastrophic forgetting of pre-training knowledge. The paper presents a comparative analysis of the MOFO and ATOM optimizers in fine-tuning large language models, LLMs, for common sense tasks. It is observed that MOFO significantly reduces the amount of parameter movement during fine-tuning, leading to a closer convergence to the pre-trained model. This reduction in parameter movement also mitigates catastrophic forgetting, as evidenced by lower pre-training loss and higher accuracy on common sense tasks compared to the atom optimizer. The loss landscapes of Pythia 160 meters after fine-tuning on a subset of the Flan dataset using both atom and MOFO are visualized in Figure 3. The results show that MOFO reaches a closer point to the pre-trained model, with minimal fine-tuning loss and lower pre-training loss compared to atom. Table 2 provides the performance of Pythia 160 meters on common sense tasks, including Hella Swag, ARC Easy, and ARC Challenge, after being fine tuned with the Atom Optimizer and MOFO. The results indicate that MOFO significantly mitigates catastrophic forgetting, achieving higher accuracy on all three tasks compared to the Atom Optimizer. In conclusion, the paper demonstrates the effectiveness of MOFO in fine-tuning LLMs for common-sense tasks, highlighting its ability to reduce parameter movement and mitigate catastrophic forgetting. This has implications for the development of more efficient and effective optimization strategies for large language models. The paper introduces MOFO, a novel optimization algorithm designed to efficiently fine-tune pre-trained models. MOFO utilizes a momentum-based optimization strategy that adapts to the gradient norms of different parameters, leading to faster convergence and better performance in various fine-tuning tasks. The authors provide a detailed description of the MOFO algorithm, including its mathematical formulation and implementation details. They also discuss the convergence properties of MOFO, showing that it converges to a point closer to the pre-trained model than other optimization methods. In addition, the paper includes experimental results demonstrating the effectiveness of MOFO on instruction fine-tuning and continual fine-tuning tasks. The authors use LAMA 27B and Tiny LAMA 1.1B as base models and evaluate MOFO on datasets such as MetaMath QA and Code Alpaca. 
The results show that MOFO significantly improves the performance of these models in various benchmarks. Overall, the paper introduces a new optimization algorithm that can be used to fine-tune pre-trained models more efficiently. The authors provide a comprehensive analysis of MOFO, including its theoretical properties and experimental results, demonstrating its potential in enhancing the performance of large language models. The MOFO approach is a method for fine-tuning large language models, LLMs, to preserve their general capabilities while learning new tasks. This paper focuses on the TRACE benchmark dataset, which includes a comprehensive set of tasks across various domains such as domain-specific knowledge, multilingual proficiency, code generation, and mathematical reasoning. The authors introduce a set of benchmarks to assess the performance and catastrophic forgetting effects on the general capabilities of LLMs after instruction fine-tuning. These benchmarks include MMLU, Common Sense, GSM-8K, human eval, and metrics for continual fine-tuning such as overall performance, op, and backward transfer, BWT. The paper aims to evaluate the effectiveness of MOFO in preserving general capabilities while learning fine-tuning tasks, comparing it against several baseline methods. The evaluation includes changes in performance on fine-tuning tasks and general capability metrics, with the pre-trained model's performance serving as the reference point for comparison. The MOFO algorithm is compared to several widely used optimization techniques for mitigating forgetting, including full fort, L2 regularization, L1 regularization, and half fine tuning, HFT. Fine tuning results on MetaMath QA and Code Alpaca datasets are presented in tables 3 and 4, respectively. In table 3, MOFO achieves a score of 47.7 on GSM 8K in the math task significantly mitigating catastrophic forgetting of general capabilities. It outperforms full FT and HFT in preserving general capability, showing an average improvement of 0.4% in MMLU, human eval, and commensense. MOFO also outperforms L1 and L2 regularization on GSM 8K by more than 3.2% and 8.7%, respectively, and shows no decline in MMLU. In Table 4, the results of fine-tuning on code Alpaca further demonstrate the effectiveness of MOFO in both optimization and mitigating catastrophic forgetting. Overall, the MOFO algorithm provides a promising approach to fine-tune pre-trained models without significant loss of general capabilities. The table on page 9 of the research paper presents the performance of LAMA 27B on the coding generation task, human eval, and its general capabilities after fine-tuning on the code Alpaca dataset. MOFO achieves comparable performance in human eval while significantly mitigating catastrophic forgetting of general capabilities. It outperforms full fort, HFT, and L2 regularization on human eval accuracy by more than 3%, and shows comparable results to L1 regularization with only a 0.1% difference. In terms of general capability, MOFO demonstrates the least degradation compared to other baselines, with an average accuracy reduction of only 1.1%. The paper also explores the performance of MOFO in continual fine-tuning on the TRACE benchmark. It sequentially trains tiny LAMA 1.1b on the TRACE dataset, which includes eight tasks from different domains. The multitask learning, MTL, method is used as an upper bound for performance comparison. Additionally, the paper considers several traditional methods from the field of continual learning, such as replay and gradient of episodic memory, GEM, which can be orthogonally combined with MOFO to further enhance performance. The table on page 10 of the research paper presents the OP and BWT scores of Tiny Llama 1.1b after fine-tuning on the trace benchmark. The results indicate that MOFO outperforms full FT and HFT in continual learning, and it can combine well with traditional continual learning methods. Specifically, MOFO with an update fraction of 5% achieves the best results among these methods in each group, with an OP score of 41.3 and a BWT score of 5.4. Furthermore, when combined with the GEM method, MOFO provides a 0.9% improvement on the OP metric compared to using GEM alone. Similarly, combining MOFO with the replay method offers a 1.5% performance gain on the op metric compared to using replay alone.
These results underscore the superior performance of MOFO in continual fine-tuning and its effectiveness in alleviating catastrophic forgetting. In the further analysis section, the impact of the update fraction of parameters in the MOFO algorithm at each iteration is investigated. The results show that, with a moderate parameter update fraction, MOFO can preserve pre-training knowledge and significantly enhance fine-tuning performance. The results also show that MOFO outperforms randomized BCD and gradient-filtered BCD in the fine-tuning task. The impact of the update fraction of parameters in MOFO is explored, with varying update fractions tested on the MetaMath QA dataset. Results show that larger update fractions can improve MOFO's optimization effectiveness, but beyond a 40% update fraction, MOFO's performance matches that of full featuring. However, when the update fraction exceeds 20%, MOFO's general capabilities decline, although it still forgets significantly less than full featuring. MOFO can preserve pre-training knowledge and enhance fine-tuning performance by choosing a moderate update fraction, avoiding extremes. The performance on the math reasoning task, GSM-8K, and accuracy changes of general capabilities of LAMA 27B after fine-tuning on MetaMath QA using different updating strategies in MOFO are presented in Table 6. BCD-BASED methods, including randomized BCD and gradient-filtered BCD, are compared to MOFO. All three BCD methods exhibit significantly less forgetting compared to full fort, demonstrating the effectiveness of BCD algorithms in mitigating catastrophic forgetting. MOFO significantly surpasses both gradient-filtered BCD and randomized BCD in terms of GSM-8K performance, indicating that updating parameters with the largest momentum leads to strong optimization power. The paper explores the convergence of MOFO, a method designed to mitigate forgetting in large language models, and compares it with the popular optimization algorithm, ADAM. To investigate this, the authors present a simplified example where the model's trainable parameters are denoted as theta equals theta, theta, element of R squared. They assume specific pre-training and fine-tuning loss functions, L pre-train, theta, equals theta squared plus theta squared and L fine-tune, theta, equals theta 1, squared, theta 1, squared, respectively. In this scenario, the model converges to different points during fine-tuning depending on whether ADAM or MOFO is used. With ADAM, the model converges to 1, 1, with a pre-training loss of 2, while MOFO leads to convergence at 1, 0, with a pre-training loss of 1. This demonstrates MOFO's ability to mitigate forgetting by converging to a minimum closer to the pre-training model. The authors provide insights into this phenomenon suggesting that multiple distinct minima in the loss function can be considered as different attractors. These attractors influence the gradient direction of a pre-trained model, possibly drawing the model's weights away from the nearest minimum. MOFO addresses this issue by updating only a subset of parameters during each iteration, reducing interference among attractors and allowing the model to converge to a closer minimum. The paper also discusses related works on catastrophic forgetting, a significant issue in machine learning where models forget previously learned information upon learning new data. Recent works have focused on the forgetting of models' knowledge during the fine-tuning process, particularly in the context of large language models. Researchers have proposed numerous methods to alleviate forgetting in continual learning, which involves learning a sequence of tasks. These methods are not limited to learning in a sequential manner and can be applied to broader paradigms. Generally, three primary approaches are used, replay-based methods, regularization-based methods, and architecture-based methods. Replay-based methods leverage past experiences to facilitate the learning of new tasks. The most straightforward implementation of this approach is experience replay, which involves maintaining old samples in a buffer and replaying them during incremental training. Several other variants utilize gradient information from past tasks. In LLMs, several works propose replay-based methods to mitigate forgetting. Regularization-based methods introduce constraints to preserve old knowledge. Several studies add regularization terms to the loss functions to penalize parameter changes and mitigate forgetting. Unlike these approaches, MOFO does not modify the loss function and as a result, MOFO reached better fine-tuning performance.
Architecture-based methods balance the goals of learning new knowledge and keeping the old one through model architectural modifications. LoRa, as the most popular parameter-efficient fine-tuning (PEFT) methods, modifies the model architecture by freezing the pre-training weights and introducing low-rank trainable matrices. Empirical works shows that LoRa forgets less but learns less during fine-tuning. Some variants of LoRa find applications in continual learning of LLMs. In comparison, Armofo still allows for high rank updates to achieve better fine tuning performance. Another line of architecture based methods focuses on model merging. The idea stems from the understanding that the task specific knowledge is located at a small subspace of the weight space. Consequently, various model merging methods have been proposed to simultaneously retain pre training knowledge and improve fine tuning task performance. However, these methods require an additional post fine tuning process before model merging. In contrast, our method only requires only one fine tuning stage. Block coordinate descent (BCD) involves iteratively optimizing over a block of coordinates while holding the others constant. The foundational work of Seng provides a comprehensive analysis of the convergence properties of BCD under certain conditions. Subsequent research has explored various BCD variants, including randomized BCD, cyclic BCD, and greedy BCD. Among these, the greedy variant, also known as Gauss Southwell BCD method, has drawn attention due to its ability to prioritize coordinates that yield the most substantial improvement in each iteration, thereby potentially accelerating convergence. In the realm of machine learning, BCD has also found applications. For example, Luo et al. Leverage BCD to perform memory-efficient fine-tuning of LLM and Xu and Zhang use random masking to perform this. In federated learning, Rothschild et al. Adopts top momentum value unsketch rather than our top momentum filtering to tackle communication bottleneck and convergence issues. A recent work, Wei et al. Addresses catastrophic forgetting during fine-tuning of LLMs by applying MOFO. Large language models, LLMs, often suffer from catastrophic forgetting during fine-tuning, where pre-training knowledge is lost. To address this issue, the Momentum Filtered Optimizer, MOFO, is introduced. MOFO selectively updates parameters with the largest momentum magnitudes in each parameter block, converging to a point closer to the pre-trained model compared to full parameter fine-tuning. This approach effectively preserves pre-trained knowledge. MOFO's key innovation lies in its ability to mitigate knowledge forgetting by filtering out updates with low momentum magnitudes. By doing so, it reduces the impact of fine-tuning on pre-trained parameters, allowing the model to retain its initial knowledge. The authors demonstrate MOFO's efficacy through experiments, showcasing significant alleviation of catastrophic forgetting and improved performance over traditional fine-tuning methods. The MOFO algorithm operates by first computing the momentum magnitudes for each parameter block. It then selects the top parameters with the largest magnitudes and updates them using the standard optimizer. This selective update process enables MOFO to preserve pre-trained knowledge while still allowing for fine-tuning. The authors provide mathematical formulations and algorithmic details, highlighting MOFO's efficiency and effectiveness. Experimental results demonstrate MOFO's superiority over traditional fine-tuning methods, achieving state-of-the-art performance on various benchmarks. The authors attribute MOFO's success to its ability to balance knowledge preservation and fine-tuning, allowing LLMs to adapt to new tasks while retaining pre-trained knowledge. Future work will focus on further optimizing MOFO and exploring its applications in multimodal LLMs, where knowledge forgetting is particularly problematic. The paper discusses the concept of fine-tuning deep pre-trained language models with less forgetting, as proposed by Chen et al. in 2020. This approach aims to address the issue of catastrophic forgetting, where a model forgets previously learned information when it is trained on new tasks. The authors introduce a method called recall and learn, which uses a combination of recall and learning objectives to fine-tune the model while minimizing forgetting. In addition to this, the paper also explores the use of a multitask learning framework that allows the model to learn multiple tasks simultaneously, further reducing the risk of forgetting. The authors demonstrate the effectiveness of their approach through experiments on various natural language processing tasks, showing improved performance compared to standard fine-tuning methods.
This work contributes to the development of more robust and adaptable language models that can handle multiple tasks without compromising their performance on previously learned tasks. The paper addresses the issue of catastrophic forgetting in large language models during fine-tuning, a significant problem in natural language processing. Catastrophic forgetting occurs when a neural network forgets previously learned information after being trained on new data, leading to decreased performance on the original task. The authors provide an extensive review of techniques proposed to mitigate this issue, including regularization methods, episodic memory, and multitask learning. They emphasize the importance of understanding the underlying mechanisms causing catastrophic forgetting and propose several directions for future research. The paper highlights the need for comprehensive evaluations of these techniques and calls for a standardized benchmark to compare different methods. It also emphasizes the trade-off between forgetting and learning new information, as well as the role of model architecture and optimization algorithms in mitigating catastrophic forgetting. Overall, the paper provides a thorough overview of the current state of research on catastrophic forgetting in large language models and identifies key areas for further investigation. In the realm of optimization methods, why Nesterov's work has shed light on the efficiency of coordinate descent for large-scale problems. This method's effectiveness is further enhanced by J. Natini et al.'s discovery that using the Gauss-Southwell rule leads to faster convergence compared to random selection. Moreover, Nittini et al.'s research also explores ways to accelerate block coordinate descent through faster greedy rules, message passing, active set complexity, and superlinear convergence. Furthermore, the field of language models has seen significant advancements. L. Uyang et al.'s study demonstrates how these models can be trained to follow instructions with human feedback. This breakthrough could potentially revolutionize natural language processing and machine learning applications. These findings underscore the ongoing efforts in optimizing algorithms and improving language models. They highlight the importance of continued research into coordinate descent methods and the potential of human feedback in shaping more accurate language models. As these fields continue to evolve, we can expect even more sophisticated solutions to emerge driving progress in artificial intelligence and computer science. Tawari et al. introduced a gradient core set-based replay buffer selection method for efficient data management in continual learning systems. This approach is crucial for optimizing learning processes and managing large datasets. Tuvron et al.'s LAMA2, an open foundation and fine-tuned chat model, has significantly advanced the capabilities of large language models. This model showcases the potential of large language models in various applications. In the realm of optimization techniques, Seng's work on the convergence of a block coordinate descent method for non-differentiable minimization provides valuable insights. This research contributes to the development of more efficient algorithms in machine learning. Wang et al.'s study on orthogonal subspace learning for language model continual learning emphasizes the need for efficient learning paradigms. These paradigms should be capable of handling large datasets and complex tasks effectively. The authors also discuss Wang et al.'s TRACE, a comprehensive benchmark for continual learning in large language models. This benchmark aims to standardize evaluation methods in the field, allowing researchers to compare and improve their models more effectively. Wang et al.'s NCL a data-efficient continual learning paradigm for fine-tuning large language models with instructions, is another significant contribution. This approach enables models to learn from new tasks without forgetting previous knowledge. Furthermore, Wang et al.'s research on efficient meta-lifelong learning with limited memory highlights the importance of memory efficiency in learning systems. This is particularly relevant for real-world applications where computational resources are often limited. Lastly, Wu et al.'s survey on continual learning for large language models provides an overview of the current state of the field and future directions. This survey serves as a valuable resource for researchers looking to advance the capabilities of large language models. In the realm of deep learning, John et al., 2022, have introduced a groundbreaking perspective on the Atom Optimization Algorithm. They demonstrate that Atom can converge without any modifications to its update rules, challenging the conventional wisdom that it requires adjustments for convergence. The authors provide both theoretical and empirical evidence to support their claim, 
contributing to the ongoing discussion about the efficacy of different optimization algorithms in deep learning. Furthermore, Zhu et al. 2024 address the issue of catastrophic forgetting in multimodal large language models. They propose a method called Model Tailor, which aims to mitigate this problem by dynamically adjusting the model's parameters based on the input modality. This approach has potential applications in various domains where models need to handle diverse types of data. Both papers highlight important aspects of machine learning research, focusing on optimization algorithms and model adaptability. They underscore the need for continuous exploration and improvement in these areas to enhance the performance and reliability of AI systems. The Topalpha norm is a crucial concept in understanding the properties of neural networks, and its proof is presented in Theorem 1. To establish this proof, the parameter space R caret D is decomposed into B components, each representing a parameter matrix in the neural network. The Topalpha norm is then defined as the Euclidean norm of the filtered vector where the filter is determined by the topalpha percentage of the largest entries in each parameter matrix. To verify that the topalpha norm is indeed a norm in R caret D, the authors demonstrate that it satisfies the necessary properties, positive definiteness, absolute scalability, and subadditivity. This is achieved by leveraging the definition of the filter and the properties of the norm. An alternative expression for the norm is also provided, which will be utilized later in the proof of theorem 1. The proof of theorem 1 itself involves showing that the update rule of the simple version of the MOFO algorithm can be expressed as a function of the Topalpha norm. This is accomplished by employing the definition of the filter and the properties of the norm. The result is a pivotal step in understanding the operational mechanics of the MOFO algorithm and its implications for neural network optimization. By establishing this connection, the authors provide a deeper understanding of how the MOFO algorithm operates and its potential applications in neural network optimization. The paper concludes with a detailed analysis of the Lipschitz condition for the gradient of the loss function. L. It is demonstrated that the learning rate, alpha, plays a pivotal role in maintaining the convergence of the optimization process. Specifically, when alpha equals 1 per liter, the second inequality becomes an equality, indicating optimal convergence. This result is significant as it provides a theoretical foundation for choosing the learning rate in gradient descent optimization algorithms. Furthermore, the paper discusses the implementation details of instruction fine-tuning and continual fine-tuning experiments. For instruction fine-tuning, the authors follow the implementation of Iveson et al. 2023, with specific settings for learning rate, sequence length, batch size, and number of epochs. For fine-tuning on the MetaMath QA dataset, the parameter update fraction for MOFO is set to 15%, while for the code alpaca dataset, it is set to 10%. In the continual fine-tuning experiments, the authors adhere to the default settings of the trace benchmark. They sequentially train Tiny Llama 1.1b on various datasets with different numbers of epochs and a learning rate of 1e5. The parameter update fraction for MOFO is set to 5%, and all experiments are conducted on 4A880 gigabytes GPS. Overall, this section provides a comprehensive overview of the theoretical and practical aspects of the optimization process, shedding light on the importance of the learning rate and the specific implementation details for fine-tuning experiments.